Okay, we're going to have stir fry for supper. So I took enough rice out of this to make rice pudding. I'm going to add a quarter of a teaspoon of salt. Get that stirred around in there. Since this is already cooked rice, you can start with raw rice. Uh, it would be a half a cup of raw rice. Okay, it takes a quarter of a cup of sugar. Noisy. Cup and a third of milk. This is almond milk if you prefer cow's milk. That's fine. I'm going to stir it around. Get all the starch off the bottom. Get all the starch off the bottom of the pan. And then I've got the heat turned back on. I'm going to let this cook for about 10 minutes until it thickens up. Okay, in this part, you need to keep stirring it to keep the milk from burning in the bottom. Okay, I'm going to add an eighth of a teaspoon of vanilla and a half a teaspoon. No, <laughs> an eighth of a teaspoon of cinnamon, half a teaspoon of vanilla. And while it's hot, I'm going to stir in this egg yolk. You need one egg yolk from a large egg. You have to stir like crazy. So it don't scramble. Yeah, so it's not just scrambled eggs. I'm going to share the source of this recipe. Okay, I'm finishing it off with two tablespoons of raisins. You can use any dried fruit that you like. And a tablespoon of butter. Get that stirred in really well. Get that butter melted. And then the next step will just be to put it in dessert dishes and chill it. You can eat it hot or chilled. Okay, so I'll start in. And there we go. Put a little bit too much cinnamon on these, I do believe. But I like cinnamon, so that's a good thing. And I've got enough left to go into another bowl and make a brulee after a while, so I'll add that to this. Okay. Now we're going to brulee the top of this pudding in this coffee cup. You can see it sizzling. See that sugar sizzling up there? Look, turn brown. Should start caramelizing. Okay. See, there it goes. Okay, yeah. Yeah. And there you go. And then it'll harden and have a nice hard sugar shell over the top. And this uh, torch. It's really just a torch like you get. Not a tractor supply. Tractor supply. Ten bucks. Yeah. It's not from a kitchen store. But it can be used to brown things and do the brulees. So there you go. Thanks for watching.